Here First, we go. We want to accept of gameplay opportunities to reflect more of the 2K game that everyone who plays it knows and loves. Enough audience. We want to create an experience that you know, truly embodies the competitive energy of, of the 2K League while also being accessible to the broader base of 2K users and basketball fans more generally. He said more accessible. Yeah. We got some exclusive information about NBA 2K26. NBA 2K25, how the gameplay is going to be adapted, the new possible game modes in the future 2Ks. We got Young Chalk releasing footage of how the new NBA 2K League CEO fired everyone. He goes into some details. It's, it's a lot to get into, man. Before we get into that, y'all make sure y'all like the goddamn video, man. Now, the person recording this was in the meeting where the guy didn't let nobody talk back and all that and he's recording it and changes that are coming for the oh league. just in case this does happen to be a real video i don't think it's real though it's ai i'm gonna disappear for a minute but it's not me bro i don't i i i, I this is ai bro. i don't know what this show uh, we can end of this session or in follow-up uh, afterwards now that the season's over i've called this meeting to discuss changes that are coming for the 2k league mm. uh, we're not immune to the business challenges that have impacted w changes sports more broadly I put my face cam on. I ain't never been a bit of my acting like. Uh, we have to change and adapt as a business. The good news is that we see a major opportunity at the intersection where pop culture, gaming, and basketball collide with a competitive league at the center of it. And we're in the process of evolving the 2K League into an entrepreneurial entertainment venture to tap into that opportunity. I'm going to be real. He just said so many buzzwords. It's not even funny. Listen to this sentence, bro. In the process. Hold on. Section. Listen to this sentence and listen to the words. And you know, as a result, he said, he said it simple. He, he it ain't going to just be about the sweaty no lives with no following. He's going to put some people with cloud in that. People care to watch because the gameplay is so atrocious to watch. That 2K design. You have to change and adapt as a business. Right here. The good news is right that here. we see a major opportunity at the intersection where pop culture, gaming, and basketball collide with a competitive league at the center of it. And we're in the process of evolving the 2K League into an entrepreneurial adventure to tap into that opportunity. Use your context clues, Chuck. We're busy at work finding <laughs> what this he is. He, you just see him keep. You keep, you see him keep fiving down, bro. Looking at the script. Competitive perspective. And uh, <laughs> my aim is to keep this group and the broader 2K League community uh, updated on on the progress. There are three things that I can say definitively uh, about the future at this point. First, it's a showcasing competitive 2K. But the the format. The structure and the range of participants will change in the next version. Um, NBA franchises will continue to, and we're working closely with them. So he's still gonna have NBA 2K League teams. Like, 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 like. Over the next several months, to find what that looks like. And third, I guess two parts to this to this third point. First, I can confidently say that we'll continue to have 2K players, 2K League players under contract. So 2K League players, so what, they gonna have one per team or something? I thought it was gonna be none of them, but I guess they might keep certain ones. But y'all are gonna hear later on what he says. So maybe, cause y'all know be a 2K League player is like 0.0001%, but now it's gonna be even lower. Is it gonna be about clout or skill? That said, I can't promise number, nature of the contracts, or the location of, of where the player. And I fully mm -hmm. appreciate that this uncertainty impacts your lives. The time we're taking now is required to ultimately build a more competitive or popular competitive platform. I can't put the details at this stage. I, I do want to share some of the kinds of changes that we're we're going to explore. Here First, we go. We want to accept of gameplay opportunities to reflect more of the 2K game that everyone who plays it knows and loves. Y'all hear this, right? Now, why why would he say this? This is the 2K League CEO. What is he saying? He's basically saying that in the future iterations of the 2K League, if if this come back and they just don't drop everything, which I'm hearing possibility after these 18 months, it's basically something I've been echoing forever. They're basically the 2K League builds. They're going to be more closer to retail. So you can really see how skilled these players are because they be nerfed play a much more simpler game because they have less stamina so they might just more basic combos and not get a little freaky with it and they might miss open shots because their builds are restricted they don't have shooting boosts so or their builds just aren't as good so when a when an npc negative one percent casual who got the ego crazy ego when he's looking at you missing and all he's not gonna he's just gonna think you're horrible you're like Man, I always hit corner shot. 
So you, he's just gonna think you're horrible. And he's like, he's not gonna really, un he was playing on retail, it will be much better. And um, I think good, bro. So you can really see how good uh, these people really are at the game. Or it could also mean that they're gonna have 2K League type builds built into game, like a mode. A second. We do want more players and celebrity participation, and we're in the working on how to make that happen. And NBA player, I wonder how. Maybe presenting. So as y'all can see, the information we had in the last video was true, because now we we get to hear it from his mouth. NBA players, celebrity, 2K League players, and content creators are going to be on teams. Third, the current the current broadcast just well not NBA, maybe some turnies isn't reaching a wide enough audience. We want to create an experience that. You know, truly embodies the competitive energy of, of the 2K League while also being accessible to the broader base of 2K users and basketball fans uh, more generally. He said more accessible. Also being accessible to the broader base, create an experience that you know, truly embodies the competitive energy of, of the 2K League while also being accessible to the broader base of 2K users and basketball fans. And accessible, so like, everyone will be able to it somewhat more casual, friendly, or it could just mean more of not the same builds as them. So I don't I don't know, bro. Maybe they're saying the integrated. He is doing a lot of word mumbo jumbo, man. More generally. From a timeline perspective, he is going to take a decent chunk of time to, to build that. 18 months from now is NBA 2K26, man. So 2K25, you might start going into the direct they want to with 26. But 2K26, hey. I'm just saying, man, I, would, I feel like 22K is an apple. Oh, we got the other part. Do we look at the other part? They view buying. <laughs> Do we look at the other part, bro? No, I'm not gonna lie. Like I said, I know I'm, I know I'm getting rid of all you guys' jobs, and I don't really get. He literally just said, "I know all of you guys have lost your jobs," and I'm personally, I understand that it sucks, but I don't. Get I'm gonna be real though. The league is gonna end up popping off because of this. No, he is actually gonna be better off because of this. It's and true. Retool the part of it more specifically. We're working towards a seat with that in mind. We're working Those are gonna be doing the same thing. So we'll begin at some point in the second half of 2025. We're going to be building the new version of this of, of the business in the league with a lot of input from the basketball community and the 2k community and during this process there will definitely be opportunities for you all to participate that's how you know it's ai it's a little delayed uh, that's how you know it's ai it's delayed shut up so i'm going to uh, turn to, to q a hey tournaments i got your question today or if, if you have questions in the coming days uh, weeks please reach out to alan job first <laughs> no, it is actually uh, will five on five be limited? Answer is that everything's on the table now. We are we're looking to look at a variety of structures, and the only thing I can say. Hey, if you ain't got five v five, you got less people to pay. For sure, is that it's, it's probably not going to be exactly the same as as the current structure. Wait, y'all weren't? I'm like looking at this room, and I don't even see no chat. Damn. Recorded. <laughs> Damn. Bro. I don't see, bro. There's nobody in the chat. We recorded they ass. And they hit y'all with the pre-record. Oh, they violated. Oh, no, 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 no. That's getting wicked. Y'all got hit with the rerun of the firing. They ran your firing. They sat there when they recorded it, and they said, what is the most likely question they're going to ask? Is 5v5 gone? Oh, my gosh. They cooked you. Holy. Oh. Bro, no shit, right? Before one of y'all said that, I'm sitting here looking at the chat room, and it says chat disabled. I don't know if y'all can see it. Hold on. It literally says chat disabled. It quite literally says chat disabled. Chat is off. This is fake Q&A with himself for three minutes. Oh my gosh, he does not give a f holy. And the only thing I can say for sure is that it's, it's probably not going to be exactly the same as <laughs> as the current structure. Another question: Can we still work with NBA? Bro, teams? and you nobody type can still work with NBA teams? Oh. First, first question: Will five on five be eliminated? Answer is that everything's on the table now. We are we're looking to look at a variety. He's got his buzzwords here, got his answers here, and he's got his questions here. So he said, first question, will 5v5 be still be a thing? Um, we're not 100% uh, sure what 5v5 will be. We're looking to be innovative and through acquired partnerships and business ventures, and we're not entirely sure. I should, bro, he's hitting the flash card death. Say for sure. Oh my God. That's just smart though. You said you wonder how many times they recorded. This was a one take. They hit y'all with a one take and did not give up. I'm sorry. I know I keep stopping. But there's real with y'all with the word opening shit up for questions and you said chat disabled. That is insanity. Another question. Can we still work with NBA teams in the off season? Yes. Uh, that's based on a player by player. Who the asked that? What NBA team is working with any of y'all? <laughs> Can we still work with NBA teams in the off season? Y'all, what the? NBA teams ain't working with y'all. a realistic question. Who the asked that? Oh, yeah, it's a great question. You bought the Blazer 5 Gaming. I know you were thinking about maybe doing a partnership with some of the Blazers over there. So, uh, yes, you can. What the? Is next question is that happening to the 2K League staff? All right, everybody. Um, <laughs> Get them all up out of here. <laughs> These are crazy questions. Let's just acknowledge 
the level of crazy, level of crazy questions in this shit. Question one is 5v5 gone. Question two, can us random 2K League players keep working with NBA teams? Question three, are we all fired? What? What? Oh, man. It gets worse? Next question, is there anything happening to the 2K League staff? Yes, to best support the evolution of business, there are going to be some more changes. Oh my God, he's hitting you with every buzzword in the book. He's hitting you with every buzzword in the book while he lays you off. He can just tell you that you're fired. He's hitting you with words. His vocabulary is so expensive. Extensive, I'm sorry. His vocabulary is so extensive. He's hitting you with, in order to get the evolution of his business. The evolution of his business. What? Um, is, next question. Is there anything happening to the 2K League staff? Yes, to best support the evolution of business, there are going to be some more changes uh, and impact on the 2K, 2K League staff. Fire uh, on them. This is uh, it's unfortunate, but it's a necessary process for uh, for the transition ahead. Next question. What the, does that mean? What did he just say? I'm not gonna lie. They knew, when they brought him in, they knew what they were doing. He came in to clear house because he just said so many words and said nothing. He just basically said, evolution and, and re re revolutionize this business, something, something, there will be some changes. He, that was an elite hire. He has 10 million percent restructures. So I'm going to be real. He knows nothing about what's going on. He has no clue anything 2K League related. He probably didn't watch a single game this year. Right. He knew the day he signed the dotted line, these were gone. The day that he signed the dotted line, everybody was gone. I'm telling you right now. That's what a he lot of people do He woke up late and the alarm went off. He didn't feel like talking to any of you losers. Listen, I'm telling you right now. I rolled out of bed. He's like, I got to talk to these losers. Where are my spark notes at? Where are my questions at? Oh, let's go ahead and talk to you guys. Get on there. Oh, wait. My fake questions are right here. I'm sure they'll ask me by V5. I'm sure some losers going to he has a chance of working with a 2K league, uh, an actual NBA team. God bless. Y'all got fired by Joe from you. Y'all know who just fired Joe? Hold on one second. I, I know. Hold on one second. They literally, huh? <laughs> they got this straight off of the set of you just to fire that of y'all. Oh my God. Hey, when he signed his contract, this is looking at the bushes. You guys were all excited that you had to do GM, Brendan Downey, you stepped down. You guys were all excited. Meanwhile, will I have a job next season? Oh! This is uh, unfortunate. It's a necessary. Uh, oh, that's the worst one. Oh! Stutter! <laughs> will I have a job next season? He said, he said, he said, let's cut the. Will any of us have a job? Let me figure out what buzzwords I can say to let you know that you're f void. Next question. Oh! Will I have jobs in? There will definitely be players under contract in the updated of the league, but at, at this moment, we can't definitively on the number or the or the structure of contracts. He just basically told y'all, no, you will not be signed back. You're a fan. You all had your chance. You're gone. Yeah. You're gone. Another question. <laughs> You're gone. Are there opportunities to participate in the next 12 months? Yes, we are planning to run a series of tournaments in this stretch, which will be an opportunity for the player. Uh, the opportunity. So in the process of developing these these tournaments, and once we have, uh, we'll be touch. Everybody, now we're getting somewhere. It's gonna be tourneys within the next 12 months. I don't know, probably to get in the 2K League or make some money. I don't know. Oh, if you lost your job, y'all didn't feel sorry for me when I lost mine. Welcome to unemployment. How does it feel? Nobody cares about you now. You see it, right? You guys are sitting at home. You got fired. A little quick 10-minute phone call. Sucks, huh? He's already turned this around. I like this guy. Hey, tournaments for 12 months, everybody. Tournaments for the next 12 months. Tournaments for the next 12 months, guys. The new GM is getting the train back on the tracks. Listen, I, I know this is, this is a lot to digest, and, and it's hard to hear. I'm, oh, I'm going to be honest. I haven't. Hold, I'm gonna talk. That has committed a lot to the league and, and over the last uh, seven seasons. But the time... It's time for me to evolve. Um, oh! Oh! Don't pull no views! Oh! I understand that it's hard for you to hear this, but you guys are holding us down, dead weight. It's time for us to evolve. You uses our cutting. It's time for us to evolve. Oh! This is a group that has oh. a lot to the league this year and and over the last season. But it's time. It's time for me to evolve uh, as business. And the league is going to run heavily, and okay. there will be opportunity in the months ahead for many of you to participate uh, in pilot events and formats. And he, uh, we built into the game. Probably for 2K25, man. It's probably going to be built into the game. 2K League was the combine. They brought it back, I think, last year or maybe this year. I don't even remember. But uh, y'all let me know if you're excited for that. I'm sure that'll be in 2K25 if they got it now or something. I don't know. That sharpen in the months ahead. We, we have really big ambitions for what this can become, and it's gonna take some time to build. Hey, I'm not gonna say who recorded this, but you hear the motherfucker that recorded it in steaming right now. You see, you hear him breathing hard in the background. He's ready to punch something. Listen to his, listen to his side. That's <laughs> in the months ahead. It's really big ambitions for what this can become, and it's gonna take some time to build. As we make progress, 
we hope to continue working with any of you in the broader 2K League community to build the next version of, of this league, which should be bigger and brighter than, than even before. And that said, I want to thank you again for all of your time and- I'm uh, crying. We'll, uh, Dang! Here we go. We'll go ahead. Hold on. Let me, let me pack somebody up. This chat's not moving like a thousand viewer chat. Tight, bro. This chat's moving in slow-mo, bro. Tight. I'm viewing out of this chat, out of this stream right now, bro. Tight, bro. All the viewers in here are fake, bro, while they're on ad 9 of 12. It's fake as in here. I'm not gonna lie. Whoever's kid this is in the background, you by the way. Whoever's kid this is in the background is a W, bro. They're crying because their father got laid off, bro. <laughs> bro, they owe Hell, kid, yo, bro. Chuck, you <laughs> tripping. <laughs> what the? Of this league, uh, which should be bigger and brighter than than even before. And uh, with that said, I want to thank you again for all of your time and uh, your effort. We will uh, we'll be in touch. Thank you. So you took five questions. Damn, bro. Golly. Five questions and he's been gone. Five questions later and he's been gone. I'm going to be honest with y'all. I think the new league is in good hands. I think the lead is in good hands. It's hard to tell it if Chalk is trolling he or not. It, he called it. Saw it, man. Useless, undeserving, ungrateful. That have been gotten, <laughs> that have gotten contracts for the last seven years. And in order for us to evolve, we got to cut the dead weight. It's a lot of dead weight. And we got to get to evolve. No, I'm not going to lie. The evolve is crazy. Crazy. I'm up. I want to go back to the one question, bro. Hold on. I'm sorry. I got to go back to the one question, bro. The question where he said, will I have a job? So that uh, is the craziest question. So this guy got a nice tweet. Tutu -tut never supported the league. This is true. It was never in the game like that. If it was in the game, he builds like a separate mode. You didn't have to pay. You could play with the build. Man, that would bring a tremendous amount of viewership. It'll make people have more respect for him. And uh, it'll give people a place to play. They didn't have to spam money. They'll never do that. Imagine a preset build mode of 2K League builds. Everyone would play that instead of playing online. And I'm saving my money. I'm tired of you. That's why 2K would never look like that, man. But that would be a great thing to do. It would make people way more happier, but they don't care about happy. So apparently Alienware sponsorship loss, ESPN broadcast failure, fake vaccine cards, Throwing games for prize picks money. This might be one of the biggest failures in Emmett history. And uh, I guess they lost the uh, Jordan brand sponsorship. It's all based off him. I have no idea. People don't listen, man. Pe people too arrogant, man. They they think they know everything, bro. And the big heads, they don't listen. You, you When you're rich, man, you don't have to listen. And you sometimes you can really escape from the realities of life. Everything's working. It's because you're always in the positive. So you can't really see what's more effective and more efficient in the future. You know, they making all this money and all this and that. They finesse fake numbers. And they, don't, they don't understand, bro. They don't understand. Go and do the clean route. Have people announcing the whole time. And it's not a game where people really care about the gameplay, bro. They're, they're not going to sit there and watch that. <laughs> It don't matter if it don't matter if no other esports does it. They're stupid. That's why e it isn't esports having a tremendous problem, bro. No one cares about no announcer, dog. Unless someone's like I'm hurt. I don't know if they even exist, but bro, I want to hear the in-game chatter. It's funny. That's why people watch content creators. They want to hear that. That's what they want. They want that connection. They want to hear the ahs, the ease. The L, P's, the Q's, C's. Hey man, if y'all wanna hear about 2K League players coming out saying they finesse prize picks in the 2K League and the whole 2K League was rigged and they was throwing games so they could get hella money. 1.6 mil in three days lost. So uh, video I did on uh, this whole 2K League stuff yesterday. Went in depth. Click the vid on the screen. But hey, hey, here we go again. Break it down. Yo, the top of the dome, dome.